Splash? Yeah. Hey, yo, Splash, yo. I fuck with y'all festival. Invite the whole mob this summer, yo. Real talk, bro. Splash Mac, uh, and together with the ASAP mob in Berlin today. First of all, thanks so much for coming out tonight. No doubt. And I thought, like, before we start, um, maybe we can just start a little reintroduction round. If all right, I'm ASAP Ferg. I'm Ian Connor. ASAP Ant. ASAP Nas. ASAP Twelvey. ASAP <clears throat> Ills. I'm Lil Pretty Flacco Jody the Second, aka ASAP Motherfucking Rocky. And I heard like AKA the saddest boy in America. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he sad? He's so sad. <laughs> Crazy at the you mean at the sound clash? Nah, before the sound clash. We won that shit. We were smashing on niggas, but they ain't want the Yankees to take the trophy. Yeah, I guess it's kinda hard to compete with like the, the UK nah, rappers. They said we really won on, on the internet. <laughs> no, they said we won on the internet according to like they ruled us as the winners on, on the you, internet. You had like eight million votes. I saw that. That was like pretty impressive. So Yeah, but we ain't gonna get all technical and all that. <laughs> <laughs> I got some shit for y'all. Y'all think y'all slick? Hating ass old niggas, B. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I was wondering, what's up with the rest of the mob? Like, is everybody here in Berlin tonight? Um, nah. Nah, not everybody's here in Berlin, but we had the whole mob in London, and it felt incredible to have all my bros out there. I'm having my man Ty Wild rev up the bikes, and you know what I'm saying? It was came out here, Addy out here, Fur, ASAP Ian, Rocky Nash, we got Jay Scott back out here. Man, everybody out here, so it's just a great feeling to have all the energies. Baby. And um, I heard something funny on the internet, because somebody asked me, somebody was like, so who, who is in the mob and who's not? Because there's like a ton of people. There's also like Lou, Lado, and all of them. Yeah. Um, so I didn't really have like an exact number. And then I Google it, and uh, something that popped up was that Shia LaBeouf is in the mall. <laughs> is that true? Shia LaBeouf is in the ASAP mall. Really? Shia LaBeouf is officially ASAP mall. That's fucking sick. There's a lot of people that's ASAP that you don't know about, bro. Yeah. Like ASAP Mikey. <laughs> <laughs> Who that? Call my man Mikey Owa, B. ASAP all over, B. I told you we a billion deep. She ain't believe me, B. Whenever we gotta pull somebody foul up and figure out who they are, we call up our man Mikey Owa, and he gonna get everything situated for us. It's really the mall. Dad's got him on speed down. Now 12, he got him on speed down. I'm trying to get his number on 12 right now. Nah, I sent it to you. What's up? What we need? For crazy, so. What what does somebody have to do to become a mob member? I mean, you yeah. gotta go through the dungeons of fire. Yeah, you gotta go through the dungeons of fire. And jump over the two mountains. Yeah. <laughs> you know. I did my homework. Or you gotta you gotta crowd surf the whole time for playing work work remix and shop. But you gotta crowd surf that whole time. On top of your head. They might not cut it. They might have to do some more extra shit. That's extreme right there. You could die that crap. So if you can crowd surf for like the whole four minutes of the song, three minutes? If you can crowd surf and you got a bad bitch passer. <laughs> you gotta get beat up a bunch of times like me. <laughs> that don't make you official. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. You have, to, you have to do some explanation. Like, you have to explain the situation, so. Uh, I beat him up because I want him to be able to wait, beat me up one day, I All guess. brothers beat brothers yeah. up. That's just how it goes. he's going to catch me <laughs> slipping. You know, I ain't tripping, even though it's not like you going to catch him slipping when he sleep. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's about it. That's my little bro, though. You know, I love Ian. ASAP Ian Connor. His name is not Ian Connor. His name is ASAP You think he Ian just Connor. got some bitches by saying that? Fuck out of here. Crazy. But yeah, um, about that uh, Shia LaBeouf thing, I, I heard you recruited him for a crew. No, that was 12. 12? Shia LaBeouf, no, that was actually ASAP Yams and Dash. ASAP da um, Dash and him. We was at a New York show, and he, he just happened to be there, you feel me? And I was actually surprised when I walked up and seen him throwing it. I was like, yeah, that's Shia LaBeouf, bro. 
You know what I'm saying? That's my man from Holes and all that, man. We got my man Zero from Holes on deck, too. He recruited Shia LaBeouf, actually. You feel me? So it was lit after that. <laughs> That's the shit, though. Um, so another, another thing I wanted to ask you guys is, you guys are like a strong crew. You have like a strong following. You're actually a movement. And um, yeah, family. Yeah, and the crazy thing is like you had, before you guys, you had Dipset, and now you have like other crews. You have like Pro Era in them. And how come like in New York, there's always like, if people do shit, they do it together, like as a group. And then they have like these strong movements that actually branch out into fashion and all these different aspects besides music. Why is that, is that a New York thing? Uh, I left, I don't, I don't know how to answer I that one. That shit. I think it should be a New York thing because New York don't stick together. I feel like everybody in New York usually got a mentality to where it's just every man for themselves. And that's that kind that mentality is like really what dominates the hip hop culture. Every man for themselves is crabs in a barrel. I think unity is the best key, but you know, some people are blind, some people don't want to see that. A lot of people are scared to let other people shine. That's just the devil in them. You know, at the end of the day, we we're in the anarchy, we're in a world all by ourselves, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, we we know that, you know, God made rules and law I mean, man made rules and laws. You know what I mean? But God made right and wrong. So we just be on our fuck society shit. It's ASAP worldwide. And, you know, I guess, you know, uh, uh, Joey Fats and them, they, they feel the same way. So they got their own crew. You feel me? I don't think it's just a New York thing. I just think that, you know, when it comes to making a posse, New York know, knows how to do it well. But I think it should just be a hip hop thing. Whereas you got New York, the Midwest, the South, the West Coast really, you know, sticking together as one genre and shit. Because at the end of the day, we, you know, uh, hip hop is looking real weak right now. So, Re, what do you think? Yes. It's crazy because like that was like one of the points I wanted to make tonight that like the the state of hip hop right now, especially in New York, is that there's like so much strong stuff. I mean, you're like probably the most visible crew out of them, but you have like even other people, like even <laughs> young kids or kids like Bishop Nehru, who's like 17 or what, and he gets signed to Mass Appeal, and suddenly you have like all this like pretty dope content or dope music coming out of and why. Out of New York, I fuck with Pro Era. I, I like Rat King's music. I fuck with, you know, man, we got love for people, but it's um it's uh about to be uh Flaco Jody season, man, you know what I'm saying? So and on top of that we got a bunch of ASAP mob shit coming out, man. Shout outs to all my ASAP mob brothers that been working hard. You know, like I said, man, if anybody wanna come team up with us and get an alliance, man, we here, man, we out here to just spread the love, keep the keep the genre strong. If y'all don't fuck with us, we don't fuck with y'all neither. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is, ASAP. Um, actually, my last question was uh, regarding uh, Lord. I actually was wondering what's up with the album because you had like two strong singles that were it's like coming soon. We just want to put out the proper product ASAP. ASAP yeah. Coming out ASAP. Oh, splash. Yeah. Hey, yo, splash, yo. I fuck with y'all festival. Invite the whole mob this summer, yo. Real talk, bro. Word. I got some good memories in Splash Festival. <laughs> Shout out to my nigga Diplo, you heard? <laughs> <laughs> I heard about that. I heard about that. <laughs> it was crazy when Diplo busted the interview. <laughs> no, when Diplo busted in on somebody getting his dick sucked by a bad bitch. That's what we talking about. <laughs> a lot of niggas die due to these streets. A lot of mamas cry. Do to this beat, purple Kush got me high. Don't wanna leave. See my daddy in heaven. He beat a the picture, man. Fuck that. It's Diplo right here, man. Hey, man. What's up, bro? What's going on? How you doing? You can't do it, but you know I could really hurt somebody with my words, like so. Don't, don't kiss, don't kiss me. Okay.